Hey guys, today I've got a really awesome opening. I've got a 2004 Japanese booster pack collector's tin. And there's not a lot of these tin openings on YouTube to sell. Let's see, piece of paper. I'm gonna save this opening. Let's see. So, as you can tell, it's really old school. It doesn't come with a Black Cluster Soldier, but. Still pretty cool. And the variant card in this is an ultimate rare Chaos Emperor Dragon. Nice. And yeah. Right. I'm gonna just leave that there. You know, I'll just put it, put it down there. Okay. And this is how it's sealed. And there it is. I think I'll keep it in its protective plastic, you know, for now. All right, and we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs, seven Japanese packs. And you can tell these are old because they've still got Yugi on them, which I wish they still had. So yeah, let's get right to it. And I'm gonna start with Duelist Legacy Volume Three. And hopefully I get at least a foil out of these. So we got the Water Spirit, as far as I remember. Alright. And these are old cards that I don't even remember. Um, yeah. Dark Spirit of the Silent, you know that. So, yep. Alright, Duelist Legacy Volume 4. Tiger Axe, the card Joey uses, cool. Twin Headed Thunder Dragon, sweet. Let's see, Blue Medicine, uh, Chimera, I think, and that. Alright. Okay, and Duelist Legacy Volume 5. Reptilian, I know that's in its name. Gradius's option. Reckless Greed, nice. Uh, the one that can attack directly from Feral Servant. And the Rabbit Spirit thing. Man, I'm butchering these names. Alright, now for the Japanese version of Ancient Sanctuary, as you can tell. There's Archlord's Rabbit. Okay. Hmm. Can't re remember these names. I know the picture. Uh, Vampire Lady, Wall of Revealing Light, and Ninjutsu Art of Transformation, I think. Alright. And I think these have the Archfiend cards in it since there's the Skull Archfiend Lightning on Upside down. Uh, Deathwork Archery. Tarek, uh, not Tarek King, Checkmate. But it seems like a longer name in Japanese. Uh, Battle Scarred. Dice Reroll, I think. And sweet, a rare <laughs> Metalizing Parasite. Okay, is that my first rare? Yeah, that's my first rare. As you can tell, it's really hard to get rares out of these. Okay, and then the pack with Black Luster Soldier. What I got. Right. Uh oh. I have a feeling that's a really good card. Alright, so Spatial Collapse. So some of these are from Invasion of our version, Invasion of Chaos. Primal Seed. Uh, I don't remember. Um, Chaos Necromancer. And holy wow. Holy crap, a secret rare Chaos Semper Dragon. Damn, it's probably not worth much, but just pulling in that is awesome. Alright, now the second half of our version of Invasion of Chaos with uh, Dark Magician and Chaos in it. Oh 
Oh my god. Okay, there's probably not hollow in here, so let's continue. Um, Balloon Lizard, Mad Dog of Darkness, Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness, Stealth Bird, and Amphigurus Bugroth MK3. So yeah, that was a really interesting opening. We got, I got one rare Metalizing Parasite, and I managed to pull one secret slash parallel rare Chaos Semper Dragon. So yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this really awesome tin opening. I know I did. And I will see you guys next time. So peace out, guys, and thank you for watching. All right, bye, guys.